Diana Denmark here, rah, rah, rah. Happy Monday morning, you know me, I love Mondays, always feels like a fresh start. And fresh would be the word to describe the weather here in Denmark this morning. It was below freezing uh, and I'm just back from my skinny dip in the sea and, and I'm very, very glad to be wearing, I've got my thermal trousers on today, uh, my thermal underwear, thermal t-shirt and I've got my big uh, woolly scarf. Anyway, I'm, I'm warming up nicely and uh, I'll, 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 I'll talk you through my, my little daily exercise in a wee minute. Anyway, what are we doing today? Well, it's the start of a new week uh, and we're also moving from one month to the next. We're going from March to April, which means that this week for our Fly Lady cleaning, if you want to focus your decluttering by zone, as I, that, that's the way I do it. Uh, we're going to be working in two zones. We're going to be working in zone five, Sank, which is the uh, living room, den, family room, wh wherever you kind of congregate. And the other zone this week will be zone one, which is, <coughs> excuse me, um, wherever you come into your house, maybe it's via porch, maybe it's through a garage, uh, your hall, entryway and uh, a dining room if you have a dining room. So we're working in two zones today, but don't, uh, sorry, it's two zones this week, but don't worry about it, we have a plan, we have a plan. Uh, and I want to also check in with you and tell you uh, about my morning routine. And also, I did a whole lot of decluttering. Let me see. I had I, I did a whole lot of decluttering yesterday uh, because I, I was talking to Mum in Scotland on the phone, and I always wear my little headset so I, I can be like doing the ironing when I'm chatting to Mum or doing a wee spot of decluttering. So I've got a whole pile of things to show you. Anyway, um, without further ado, I tell you what. We'll, we'll start with morning routine. Uh, make sure, please, before you go into uh, YouTube, because I, I know you come here for motivation, but don't, don't get stuck here. I said, hey, set a timer before you go into YouTube or before you go into Pinterest looking for some kind of menu ideas. Um, set, set a timer before you start, so you're actually going to get up off your bahuki afterwards and, uh, and move and do something. Morning routine. Uh, and, and if you need help with this, it's all in my Fly Lady Refresher course videos and, and you don't need to call it a control journal. We, we actually, I think it was when we did one of the Fly Lady Refresher course things, uh, I asked you to give me your best ideas for your names of what you're calling it. Um, I'll see if I can find the video. Anyway, I, I call mine Hooga Home because it, you know, it's something that supports me and makes the, the home hoogly and uh, supports me in general. So from the, uh, from the top, uh, and this is my personal uh, morning routine, yours make me look very different. Um, I got up, uh, coffee, uh, showered, dressed shoes, check. Um, the load of laundry, my lol <laughs> load of laundry, that will be going on later today. Um, <clears throat> dishwasher, we ran that uh, yesterday, that doesn't need done yet. And, and remember, as I said to you, I've been saying to this to you since, since we went into lockdown, don't worry about the order of things or don't worry about the timing of things if you're also in some form of lockdown like we are. The main thing is that you're just getting them ticked off during their day and you're, you're, you've got your plan so that you know that you're moving forward. Uh, swish and swipe in the bathroom. I did that when I had my um, shower and got my makeup on, got dressed shoes. And for everybody who asks about uh, whenever I do my exercise uh, or, you know, go for my swim in the sea. No, I, I don't go reapplying makeup afterwards. You know, I'm not swimming with my head in the sea. I'm, I, I swim heads up breaststroke. Uh, and the same after the run. I, I just, you know, take, take a, a brush through my hair uh, and maybe put in a wee bit of powder. Um, and, and reapply my lipstick, but, but that is it. Um, made the bed, yeah, aired the bed, made the bed. Um, my outfit for tomorrow, I don't know if you can see behind, I was playing with some outfits uh, yesterday while I was doing some decluttering here, so I've got an outfit ready to go. I'm not sure if I'll go with the scarf or the necklace, we should see. Um, and my exercise for today, check, I've already been for a swim in the sea. Uh, and my self-preservation for today, um, I, I think I'm going to take a, a nice half an hour of my favourite reading chair this afternoon and do some extra reading. So ju just, you know, look at these things. So what, what are you needing to get ticked off? Ju just go through your list, but don't worry about the timing of it. Right, on to the next thing, which is the Fly Lady Zones. 
Um, and I'll tell you what I'll, I can tell you what the what the missions are this week. Uh, I, I like, I've got my wee cleaning caddy. You've seen my wee cleaning caddy, and I, I like to keep it in the zone. So if I've got a few minutes in the zone. Uh, I, I can just do a wee bit. I'm, I'm not spending hours in, uh, you know, zone cleaning every day. Okay, so the first couple of missions, hold on a minute. Let me just check this. Okay, are you ready? Uh, now, these are the Fly Lady missions. Remember, you don't need to do all these missions. Uh, you can also pick something, you know, if you, you made up one of these from your cleaning list, you just go whatever uh, needs done, you know, well, what's the, the most pressing task. So for zone five, which is the living room, uh, first mission is to give a really good vacuum, you know, a detailed vacuum, uh, you know, if you can get underneath the, the furniture, you don't need to be moving heavy furniture, please, please don't go thinking that you have to, you know, be pulling everything out, you just get as, as good as you can get. Uh, second mission is also to look at your hot spots in the living room. Maybe you've got um, cups and glasses, newspapers piling up that you haven't read. Take, take a wee look at those. And then Wednesday, moving into zone one, uh, the hall, which is hall, uh, the porch, you know, the dining room. Um, take a wee look at your, your front door where people are coming in. Uh, maybe you've still got tons of snow there. If you haven't got tons of snow, maybe have a wee look at if you've got plant pots. I've already put out some Easter decorations and maybe wipe down the door. Um, the fourth mission for this week is in the dining room. If you have a dining room to look at the tables and chairs. Sometimes I find that, um, especially in the dining room, because we normally eat all our, our meals in the kitchen. You've seen the kitchen table. That's where we eat all our meals. Sometimes in the dining room, uh, you get wee uh, cobwebs underneath the, the table so you might want to take a wee look at that and if you don't have a dining room then maybe have a look at your kitchen table maybe you need to wipe the legs underneath uh, the baby's uh, high chairs things like that and the fifth mission for this week is to put away any coats and shoes in the hall get those hung up uh, you, you've seen our hall before if, if you're looking for my clean along with emissions they're all in this playlist Put, uh, put up there where you can actually see me cleaning in uh, along with you in the zones. I can't do that right now because the family are working and studying online. Um, my, my husband has his office set up in the dining room, my kids in, are in their rooms or sometimes they're in the living room or the kitchen so that, that's why I can't do my usual uh, service uh, videos. Um, and you may also like to wipe down, you know, uh, door handles, light switches, uh, you know, let, let, let's keep ourselves germ free. Anyway, on to the exciting part that I wanted to share with you. I just moved my cleaning carry out of the way because that's going uh, into the living room. Um, day 34 da, 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 of our 40 day declutter. And it's, it's funny, uh, and I love seeing what you are decluttering uh, you, because you can post your pictures on Instagram. If, if you post it with the hashtag Diane in Denmark, I can see what you're decluttering. And it gives me inspiration, it gives the, the, the rest of ins inspiration. And it, it's really funny how um, you've really uh, gone, uh, leaned into this. And, you know, many of us are, are on lockdown and it's just given you fresh eyes to say, you know, do, do, I really, do I really want to be holding on to this? I mean, if I'm not using it now when we're on lockdown, like books or DVDs, like when? When, when are you going to read these books if you're not reading them now when you're supposedly have uh, more time to do it? Anyway, let, let me show you what I've got from here. And as I said, I was on the, the phone to mum yesterday. Mum's doing really well, thanks. She's, uh, she's all set up at home. Now, this scarf, I'm not, I'm not uh, planning to... Um, get rid of it. I'm, I'm going to see, it, it's got these kind of dangly bits <laughs> that I don't like. I do like the colours, it's got different colours in it, but um, I'm, I'm going to see if I'm actually going to use it. If if I'm going to use it, I'll be cutting off these dangly bits, so I don't like the dangly bits. And if I'm not going to be wearing it, then I'll, I will, it will be a, a giveaway item. And remember, if, if you've got giveaway items, of course, you, you can't give them away right now. Uh, I've just set up a little area in the basement with a box where I'm putting all the stuff for the charity shop and for our next clothes swap party, but whenever that happens. So, so that one, so that, that for me is a think, think about. Let me pop that out of the way. Um, but I went through my scarves. Now that's why I'm, 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 you're going to be seeing a lot of scarves coming up in my outfits the next few days. 
Um, these scarves, I, the colour's a bit too dull on that one. Uh, I don't like the pattern on that one. And this one again is too... Uh, I just don't like it. So, so those three, um, those three are going out the door. Uh, I've also got a couple of cardigans um, that I no longer like the shape of, or uh, the colour just isn't is a bit too uh, blah. But you see, I've got quite a lot of uh, pink. But this was a close swap um, sweater, actually a nice cashmere one. Uh, also, a shirt that was my son's, and I had been wearing it for a bit, but that that can also go out. And then I've, I've taken all my belts, hold on, I have my belts in one of these, uh, you know, these hangers that go over the, the door inside my wardrobe here. And I've taken out all the belts and I've put them into a little box. And I've come up with several belts that can now go out. I have kind of soft belts and uh, colours that don't work. So all these belts are going, let me see, I've got one, two, three, four, Five, five belts. Woohoo! So I was only looking for one item, but see what happens when you start. Um, and the other thing was I had one of these uh, jewellery hangers where I kept earrings. Now all my earrings are kept there on my dresser in my little chest of drawers. And I've also got some other ones uh, which are not family heirlooms, but just things that I've had that kind of uh, kind of have memories for me, that I'm, but I'm, I'm not wearing them on a regular basis. Uh, and, and I've got those in a box and I checked with my daughter of things uh, that she might want to have but she has said no to. So I've got several, um, I've got bracelets and I've got a little necklace and I've got some earrings. There we are, let me see the earrings. There we go. Uh, and some little silver uh, bracelet things. So all those are going to. So actually I've got... <laughs> quite a good stack and that, that was yesterday just on the phone to mum when I had my headset on and it's funny how the time flies especially if you're listening to uh, an audiobook I also finished my audiobook yesterday and just anything to keep you motivated and uh, normally I'm listening to my music you know if, if I'm working in the kitchen or if I'm cooking uh, or if I'm doing my weekly home blessing I've always got the, the music going so so make sure that you have something to kind of motivate you as you go along whether you put on one of your LED candles uh, or, or a real candle, get the music going and it, it will just make it a much, much easier process for you. Anyway, on that note, let me see, uh, let me just check see if there's anything else. Oh yeah, j just for fun, I'll, I'll, I'll run a wee video of what it was like on the bathing bridge this morning. So here it comes. Good morning. It's a bit icy underfoot, so watch your step. Woo! <laughs> it's very icy. Watch out, watch out. Oh, I cannot see it. Look down there. Yeah. Let's see. Row, row, row your boat. Okay, watch your step this morning. It's very, very icy. Right, uh, have you begun? I'm going with the, I'm going on this bridge today, you can take the other. <laughs> oh, do you see how cold it was? Anyway, I had a, a beautiful swim and uh, Vibika and I were swimming, as you saw, uh, from different um, ladders. And then afterwards we sat and enjoyed our cups of tea uh, in our usual china cups. Here's a picture, I'll put the pictures here. Uh, and we were at a safe distance and uh, we just sat there and enjoyed the warm rays of the sun. I mean, even if it was just above freezing and, and there was ice underneath, it, it was just nice to take a moment, just take a moment and just be, just breathe and just be. And, and please make sure that you take uh, some time for yourself today. You don't need to be skinny dipping uh, in the Danish sea, but you know, j j just take a, a moment for you today, okay? Because if you're not gonna take a moment for yourself today, then when? Okay, so anyway, on that note, um, all I've got left to say is live long and prosper. May the Danish hood be with you. And I'll give you a wee shake of my pom-poms to send you on your merry, merry day, uh, merry way on merry Monday. And uh, ra, ra, ra. Okay, see you soon. Oh, and I'll be on Instagram today. Uh, and otherwise I shall see you here on YouTube tomorrow morning. Okay, bye for now.